This is an OB ultrasound. Uh, first thing, there's a clear IUP, and you can see the heartbeat. It's probably a normal heartbeat. Um, first, it's a little overgained. See how bright this is? It's a little difficult to see um, posterior to the uterus. And, um, so you do want to turn the gain down a little bit. But one thing I want you to focus on is that all six clips that we're saying, they're just you're just holding the probe center. And it really does help if you move the probe either um, cephalad and caudad, or if you turn the probe 90 degrees and right to left. So you can really get a good look around the uterus because this to me looks like free fluid down here. Um, you do see it on multiple clips, but again, it's the same area. And I don't have you um, fanning, and so it would be kind of helpful uh, for me to know um, how far this extends. Similarly here, I'm having trouble telling if this is free fluid or not, but it is concerning enough to me where... Um, I would call this as a positive study for free fluid. Now, patients who are pregnant, they can um, have free fluid. It could be uh, physiologic, uh, but it also could be pathologic in the setting of trauma. So, um, just something to keep aware of. Um, anyways, uh, so a couple again takeaway points. Try to fan or move the probe just so I can see um, the various areas um, around the uterus to see how extensive the free fluid is. Decrease the gain. This is too bright. And again, um, if you do see something like this concerning for free fluid, uh, most likely it is probably physiologic, but you do need to consider pathology if this is a setting of trauma. So, hope this helps. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.